Okay, now, I don't seem to understand what's going on here. You got Mayor Bloomberg now. He wants to get rid of the 32-ounce Big Gulp, right? Now, don't you think people probably don't get two 16 ounces? I mean, they're kind of like ruining the environment because you got two plastic cups you got to throw away now. I mean, does it really make sense what this man's trying to do? I know he wants people to lose weight. You know, he wants to stop people, stop smoking and ban salt. But the very next day, they have Donut Day. I mean, not the next week or maybe the next month or maybe six months from now, but the very next day, Donut Day. I didn't even heard of Donut Day. So it's okay to eat donuts, get those sugar donuts, those chocolate-covered donuts, those glazed donuts with jelly inside, but you can't have a drink to wash them down. Is that what it's all about? I mean, I don't understand. You know, in Massachusetts, kids can't sell cupcakes, but it's okay to pass out condoms to grammar school children. How does that freaking make sense, people? Is everything backwards in our society? And why does he go after alcohol? To save your liver. I mean, you want to save everybody. Hey, get that liver wants to save a liver. Exactly, right? Seriously. I mean, limit the shots to one tequila shot. You're going to bar one shot, you got to go in New York. I mean, come on. But what gets me is this. They're okay with passing out clean needles for heroin addicts. I mean, because so they don't get AIDS. We don't want anybody to get AIDS, of course. But are you promoting heroin? We don't want to get them help and rehab, but we want to give them clean needles, but then going to take the freaking soda away from the kid. Where does this make sense? You want to give out needles, but take away soda? So let's promote heroin? They're going to say, we're not promoting it. They're going to do it anyway. Okay, that's the answer. I got news for you. The guy's going to buy a freaking liter bottle, or maybe a six-pack, or a 12-pack, or a 24 case. I mean, come on. Does that make sense? You ban salt. You ban smoking, but... You want to legalize pot. What do you think people do after they smoke pot? Not that I would know, of course. You know, I mean, you know. <laughs> I was young once, but you know. It's another story. But think about it. They're going to get the freaking munchies, you idiot. They're going to go out there and drink after you smoke pot. What are they going to do? They're going to buy chips and ice cream and sodas and donuts. And yum yums. Yang yangs. Wing dangs. Wang lungs. What do you think they're going to eat when they get stoned? Huh? Are they not going to eat sugary, fattening stuff? They're going to go to Jack and the Crack and munch out, are they not? I mean, it's just common nature. I mean, you get stoned, you're going to get the munchies, you're going to eat a bunch of junk. So as Richard Pryor once said this, Mayor, have a coconut smile and shut the fuck up.